am going to get ready. I just um, did my affirmations and journaled for a little bit. That just keeps me motivated. It just gives me energy. I love journaling in the morning and like doing some little affirmations. And I love that journal that I showed you guys. I am getting ready early today just because I want to be already ready for the day. I have a lot to do today. I need to make phone calls. I need to record videos with my videographer today. And I just thought I would bring you guys along my day. Today I did not work out. I only work out three times a week just because this year and last year I've been prioritizing my rest a lot. I... I'm not like a person that goes to bed really early and if I wake up early, um, I do try to wake up early every day um, but I'm not like super super hard on myself like if I'm exhausted, I am not going to wake up super early because then I'm just in a bad mood and I'm just like pushing through my entire day. So today was one of those days that... I just needed a little bit more rest and it was one of my days that I didn't have a workout. Um, so I slept in just a little bit till like 8 in the morning. And yeah, so I'm getting ready. Happy New Year's. I am excited for the new year. I just put on some foundation and the foundation I use right now is the Frankie Rose with the brush. The Frankie Rose xl foundation brush and it's so good it's full coverage i've been loving it i just got a facial yesterday so my face is gonna be glowy and good so that's exciting i put some concealer hopefully you guys can see good the lighting here sucks i just ordered a ring light a small ring light for this area so that i can have one so I need full coverage and like a full beat today because I'm doing videos like I said. Normally when I'm getting ready I'm listening to a book. Um, I love Audible. Drinking my cafecito. My husband got these mugs. With our logo in it of our team so it's so cute isn't it i'm so excited because i actually have videos today and this week i'm going to announce that i am um taking agents to into my team and you guys it's so scary i don't know i feel like this year is going to be all about action all about doing no more talking about it I think it's just hard as a Latina to like know that you're doing something, you know, like that you have influence and that you are able to help other people and that you're doing a thing, you know, like it's so crazy, you guys, because I sell real estate and people think it's easy and some people think that it's so easy because we make it look easy, but it's actually really challenging and I'm so excited to be teaching people like how to grow their business and how to create a business in real estate. So I'm so excited to announce that. Uh, my team is going to be not a big, big team. It's going to be more like a small but powerful team. So whoever is in my team, I'm going to teach them to sell about 40 to 50 homes a year um, because I, I've i been able to do that myself, 40 to 50 homes a year um, without buying leads, without like cold calling like for sale by owners and things like that, which I did call for sale by owners before, but it was just like for extra like things that I wanted. Um... And it's not a bad thing to call for sale by owners. I'm just saying, like, I'm going to teach the agents that join my team how to sell 30 to 50 homes a year, depending on what they want, right? Because not everybody wants to be working all the time. You know, everybody's goals are different. 
so i'm excited for that make sure that you follow me on instagram and i'm gonna add in my email right here in case you guys have any referrals for me here in washington state um i am happy to give you a referral fee if you send me a client and if you're a local person that is not an agent that can't refer me people from another place um i do like if you refer me a family member or a friend or a co-worker from here from tri-cities or from anywhere i will give you a stanley cup with our little logo in it and yeah find a couple outfits for my videos i like to change that way it looks different on the little videos that i do this one i haven't never wore and it's so cute this one's from revolve i bought it a long time ago but i never wore it so that one's a cute one and then for tops i feel like i've wore everything i don't even know what to wear this one's a cute one. I think I might wear this one. It's kind of like fancy looking. I feel like I I don't know what to wear for the cute video, the video announcing that I'm taking agents in. I feel like I don't know what to wear. A blazer. I feel like I've wore every blazer so much. I'm all done with my makeup. I just wanted to get it over and done with first thing so that I don't have to like still get ready. So now I'm gonna just go into my office, make some phone calls, finish scripting the videos that I'm gonna make. And then I will put on lip gloss right before or lipstick right before my video. Um, but I already have my outfits picked out. Um, I'm doing like four of them or yeah four of them so i just have them right here it's like a cute little suit that i got on lavoot and then this one i got it at zara it's just a black suit and then this really cute sleek pants which i'll show you once we're recording the video the outfit but it's like this like suede i don't know with the shirt super cute and then this dress that i've wore a lot but i just love it i got it from zara a long time ago it looks a little different in person than in the video but so cute how cute are the little covers that i bought for my airpods or my earphones how cute are they i got them off amazon i'll link them down below actually i have an amazon thing but how cute so i'm preparing for this video let me know what you guys think how this sounds this one's for um for me taking agents in the reel that i told you guys that i'm gonna do so it's, hello i'm veronica ramos team leader of the ramos group i'm excited to announce that the ramos group is looking to expand Today, I want to extend a purposeful invitation to individuals ready to make a powerful impact in the world of real estate. I've, I've achieved an impressive 
track record selling 40 to 50 homes each year without resorting to cold calling or buying leads. Now I'm on the lookout for motivated individuals who share our commitment to success. Mentorship is the backbone of our team. As your mentor, I'm dedicated to offering unwavering support and guidance, equipping you with the skills to generate your own leads and build a thriving real estate career. Whether you're new to the industry or an experienced agent looking for a fresh start, having navigated the, no the nuances of real estate, I've discovered a pathway to success that doesn't involve pleading for business or chasing down leads. Now I'm seeking individuals, new faces, or those who face challenges ready to take on the serious commitment of building a thriving real estate career. We're not just offering a job, we're presenting an opportunity to join a community of passionate professionals dedicated to real estate excellence. Together, we'll tailor a plan for your success covering everything from negotiation strategies to cultivating meaningful client relationships. If you're ready to bring your passion for real estate to new heights, if you're committed to building a lasting career without shortcuts, consider this your personal invitation to join us at the Ramos Group. I look forward to hearing from you. Email me at veronica at ramosgrouptc.com or give me a call. Now I am looking for a house to do. I'm actually looking for two homes to do open houses this weekend. So my goal is to do two open houses every single weekend for the whole year, except obviously if like something comes up that I can't make it or something like that. But the goal is to do as many open houses as possible this year. Um, my goal is a hundred, so two every weekend and or more if I could do more, you know. Um, what else? I feel like my throat just feels a little weird right now. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing. I just posted on my Facebook, um, 2023, I was able to help about 40 families. Um, I was able to close 40 homes in a 8% interest rate market, you guys. Like, it's crazy because sometimes I'm like, oh my God, I'm not doing enough, but 40 homes in one year with an 8%, 7% interest rate. Like that's insane. I'm very proud of it. I just don't know why I'm like that with myself. Like I'm like, I could have done more. I could have this and that, but keep in mind that's 40 without buying leads, without like representing a builder. So hopefully this year I do get to represent a builder. I'm speaking it into existence and um, also I am going to start buying like Zillow leads or things like that to grow my business because that's not a bad thing. If you already got down, like I've been able to do 40 to 50 every year without that. So now it's like in order to grow, I need to do that, buy leads and then also represent a builder. So yeah. yeah. We forgot, I forgot to vlog, but we're done with the videos it was good so i just finished the videos it went really really well i did it like four or five reels so my brain is dead right now but it's okay i'm making a couple phone calls i just had some clients get pre-approved so that's exciting and then I do have a 5.30 buyers meeting at my office. So I'm going to go do that. It's already like 3.40. Um, and then I have a couple showings for a new two new construction homes. They're going to decide which one they want to go with. So we're going to look at them one more time before they decide. And then my husband right now just got an offer accepted as well. So we're working on that. And then I did get a listing under contract um, the other day, like two days ago on New Year's Day. So we've been working on that. Um, but yeah, it's going good so far. <laughs> I'm going to make some phone calls right now. But I do need to text someone. Let me see.
Veronica Ramos, sorry to bother you. <laughs> I was just calling because I noticed yesterday you signed up on my website and I just wanted, it's, I'm a realtor here in Tri-Cities and I just wanted to see if you had any questions regarding purchasing a home or selling or anything like that. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Where do you live? In Kennewick or Pasco? Kennewick, okay. And you guys already all grew it. <laughs> That's good. That's. Oh, okay. Awesome. Well, congrats. <laughs> yeah. Well, whenever you guys are ready to even just set up a meeting and just talk, let me know. I'm. There's no compromise or anything whenever you guys feel like you're ready to just get a little bit more informed and see if you guys want to do it or not. Mm -hmm. So how we... Yeah, so it's such great news. They dropped. They were like at 8%. I'm sure you heard. <laughs> and now they're like at 6%. Low 6%. So it's... I mean, it, obviously, it's not like 3% like before, <laughs> but. Yeah, and honestly, I don't see them dropping that low in a long time. And even if they do drop, um, the prices will go up again like crazy. So it's always going to be one thing or the other. Yeah. The nice thing right now is that you can negotiate like a good chunk of a house. So that's that's the benefit of right now. She's going to talk to her husband. And she said it's okay for me to follow up. guys I'm out here showing homes I'm showing some really cute homes for my clients that are first-time home buyers and then I need to write an offer so I need to just finish these showings and then I'm gonna go home and write an offer um, definitely the market is picking up after the holidays like after like January 1st, I was like, boom, under contract on my listing that was on the market for such a long time. Boom, under contract, under contract. So that's exciting. Um, I'm excited for 2024. I feel like the real estate market is going to be way better. This is the main floor. Look how cute. The dining room, kitchen. And then it has this breakfast nook that I love. And the views are so beautiful. This is the second level down. There is over 6,000 square feet on this house. So it's huge. I'm already tired. But like another master down here. Bedrooms over there. And the pool. Nice pool. And then there is like a little wet bar right here and like a dining room so that if you have people over, you could just have a table here and then you could be barbecuing and, you know, it's so beautiful. Look at this gym. It's a custom gym. I love it. 
and then it does have like a little golf cart garage over here because it is on Canyon Lakes, which is a really good golf course. I'm also showing this house. Look a cute dining table. I don't know, you can't really see it. Kitchen, living room, and I'm just gonna check that I locked the door over here before I leave. Yep, this is the backyard. She likes it, but she doesn't feel like it's the lawn, which is totally fine. And there's carpet in the in the bathroom, which it's an easy fix. But yeah, I'm gonna go show another home right now, and then um, I'm gonna be done for the day after that. Okay, I just got to my next showing. It's this small little casita. It's perfect for like a first time home buyer or someone that has like just themselves, like a couple or a couple with one child because it's two bed, one bath. Cute. So I'm currently in my office and it's already kind of late. I need to hurry. I just went over on the phone and totally forgot to vlog. Um, I went over two offers to two different clients. One of them is a new construction that we're going to, um, that we're going to submit an offer on and they need to sell their home. So it's contingent. And then the next one's like this really cute first time home buyer, affordable home, but there is two offers on it. So hopefully they get their offer accepted. So wish them luck. Um, but let me, I'm going to go ahead and send them right now. And yeah, it's Friday today, so I need to hurry so we can go do something. 